Hi, my name is Troy Jaroslowski. I go by Canadian in game. I'm the captain of Evil Genius's Rainbow Six team. I'm just here to give you guys some useful tips on the game. Since defenders are already spawned in during the preparation phase, they can prepare angles and wait for attackers to approach the building and catch them spawning in. Always try to keep this in mind when your round starts. Avoid rushing straight in after spawning. Take your time, ADS at windows and doors, make sure nothing's hit open, or even use your drone during the preparation phase to spot any windows and doors that are smacked open for a defender to peek. Finally, you can catch them off guard by pre-firing windows and doors that they might be spawn peeking from and being able to get a free kill. The biggest mistake as an attacker is being too focused on the objective and forgetting about all the rooms surrounding it. Another thing to keep in mind is that the closer you are to the objective, the more chance there is for defenders to have traps set up there. Also keep in mind that multiple defenders often roam the map. They play far from the objective and try to set up flanks for when you do try to attack the objective. Try to find them with your drone and chase them back so that they play back on the objective. That way your back is safe for the rest of the round. Remember that as an attacker, you only have two drones, so make sure that you don't waste them. During the preparation phase, as soon as you've discovered where the objective is, try to hide your drone and keep it alive. This way you can work as a team and you can only send one or two drones to discover the objective, while the others can be placed elsewhere to prepare your entry. Once the action phase starts, you can quickly get back on your drone and check if a room that you parked it in is safe or not. It's really important to remember that you do have a second drone usually. So don't forget to throw your second drone when you have the opportunity to, to gain more information. As attackers, you have a lot of utility to breach walls, hatches, and floors. Identify if a wall or hatch leading to the objective has been forgotten to be reinforced by the defenders and open it to create a direct line of sight into the objective. You can also breach floors and ceilings around the objective to put additional pressure on the defenders and make them uncomfortable in their positions. Finally, you can breach some regular walls just to improve your angles. Although defenders get quickly detected after spending too much time outside, they can still go for quick runouts in order to surprise the attackers. Remember when you get on your drone outside as well to make sure that you're under good cover and safe because that's when you're most vulnerable to be pushed. Be careful when you see a door or window barricade a bit destroyed. That can be a clue that someone is near and ready to jump outside on you. You can identify possible runouts by droning and then positioning a claymore or aiming at a window or door to cover a teammate and instantly kill someone running out. I hope you guys enjoyed this and can get use of those tips. I uh, hope to see you in game.